Well, maybe we'll start with you. I mean, obviously, it was it was a great game from a spectator point. Was it as fun to play in that game as it looked like? It really was, and especially because I feel like we played really well. We did everything we wanted to do, and um, I also just came down to like a couple shots didn't drop, like rolled out, and so. Uh, I think we're just all so proud of our effort and everything that we were able to do this season in total, too. Is that the toughest part, seeing, uh, I think it was uh, Taylor's three go in and out and then a missed layup and just, yeah. just a couple missed opportunities at the end? Yeah, exactly. And it was just one of those where they, they would make theirs, you know, theirs would roll in, ours weren't. And so uh, it was a weird feeling, honestly. Mm -hmm. it, didn't, it didn't feel real because I felt like we, <laughs> we won that. Like, mm -hmm. we did what we wanted to do. How difficult was it to not be part of that overtime for you? Um, super. It was. It's always stressful just being having to watch, um, not being able to affect anything. But I mean, I had total confidence in our team, and I know that we're so tough and we play so hard that it just. I mean, one point. That was it. So. Yeah. I was gonna say, do you feel it kind of came down to rebounding in the end? I mean, they they ended up seeming like pounding the offensive glass, especially in the fourth quarter in overtime. Uh, yeah, they're definitely a lot bigger than us, both in weight and height, I'd say. And I think we were a little on, um, at the disadvantage on rebounds. And yeah, there was definitely a couple times in the fourth quarter and all the time we could have um, got out with a few more rebounds to help us out. On that last possession there, you guys did get the rebound. And then what was sort of the, the game plan for that, that final shot um, at the end of overtime there? I'd say just to get a, the best look we could. Um, and. Car just tried to get up a shot that she thought she could, um, and we were going to get the last shot. Uh, we didn't want to leave any time for them. We wanted to win it, and um, just didn't ex come our way. I guess from your standpoint, it, it looked a little frazzled. Did it, did it feel frazzled as you guys were running the, that last play, running the uh, running the play itself? Um, I I'm, I don't know if we were frazzled. We I don't think we've been in that position before, mm -hmm. down one with the ball in our hands. Um, but I think we tried our best. We their defense kind of bothered us all night. I'd say they're pressing us out. So um, we'd been driving all night and looking to kick, and that's what we tried to do in the last second. And just they stayed on all of us that time. In the second quarter, I think they had 23 points, and next quarter you guys kind of stormed back. I think you had 23 in the third. Just that third quarter, what, what was working well for you guys during that, that comeback? Um, I would say it started on defense, and it always has this whole season. Um, I think that we were able to stop, especially their guards from, uh, we changed up how we were gonna do the ball screens, like able to get uh, one and out. And so, uh, and then us again, like Nat said, being able to drive and kick, like our shooters were open all night. And so I think that really helped. Tough to reflect at this point, but you know, you girls were picked eighth in the conference in the preseason, just, you know, and, and then had to deal with the adversity of losing a teammate during the middle stretch of the season, just how proud of yourselves are you girls for the way you guys played this year yeah um, we're very proud of ourselves our coaches are proud of us um, we got the most conference wins we did in the Mountain West that was a record we got 22 wins with seventh I think I read and then um, just for this group to get to the WNIT we hadn't done that before so as far as this year went something to be proud of then coach D told us to not hang our heads after this game it was a battle down to the last second and um, just a reflection of our whole season was that and how hard we work and so I'm really proud of this team and we're all super proud of each other and especially Haley just um, to have her end her senior year like that it's pretty, pretty awesome. I know it's, it's kind of raw right now but is this the thing that can be a, a pretty good stepping stone to this spring this summer and then into next year for you guys? Yeah I think for sure uh, getting postseason play experience especially being like we're a young team and so that's just going to help us going into next season and I think it kind of like lit a fire under us like we want to get back to the NCAA to the NIT like whichever and just get more wins like I think because we can see we can do it and we can compete with these Pac-12 teams like 